made of solid bronze, Seabirds by Trevor Askin seems to hover and possibly suspended in mid-flight. This ethereal, weightless quality is one Askin seeks to create in his works. Discussing the heavy ingots of bronze he begins with, Askin describes his sculptures as attempting to become the opposite of this material. Askin began sculpting around 1980 as a hobby and has now been doing it for over 40 years and has made over 600 works. He wanted to be involved in all stages of each artwork and so learned how to cast the bronze himself using the lost wax method. In this process, the sculpture is first formed from large, thick sheets of wax. This wax version is then coated with a ceramic slurry. Once this hardens into a shell, it can be heated so the wax melts out and drains away. White-hot molten bronze is then poured into this ceramic mould. Once it cools, the ceramic can be chipped off, revealing the one-off, unique sculpture. His wife, Elizabeth, helps him throughout this process, as the work is physical and demanding, and many aspects require two pairs of hands. Askin describes his distinctive style as curvilinear, this term captures the smooth, flowing curves and graceful abstract forms characteristic in his pieces. His subjects include abstract forms, birds, animals, and people. He seeks to make works that are uplifting to the spirit, with life, energy, and movement that defies the solidity of their materiality, or even, as here, seems to defy gravity. Balanced impossibly on a wingtip, these metal birds seem to soar. His works range in size from less than a foot high to large public statues, such as the Paperboy sculpture in Timaru at the end of the Royal Arcade. His work has been exhibited internationally and he receives commissions from all around the world, including a set of trophies for the World Gliding Championships. This demonstrates his reputation as the artist who can make bronze fly.